All right, man. So tell me about the story of this thing. Like, um, were you, were, did you know about the car, or your cousin was like, hey, you want to take this thing off me? Like, how did yeah. it go down? So my cousin bought this off the guy. So it's been in Canada for 20 years. Right on. The guy, well, not quite 20 years. It's been in Canada for like 15 years. Mm -hmm. The guy that uh, imported it had it swapped it, put it in his garage. Uh -huh. Didn't drive it for 10 years. My cousin got it off of him, and my cousin pretty much only drove it like 10, maybe 15 times in the five years that he had it. Okay. And then last year, 2020, I got this thing nice. uh, off of him. He's had it, he had it for five years, so I knew about it, but yeah, yeah. it was never a, uh, like, it's gonna come up for sale kind of thing, and he just kind of got like tired of it tired of it and nice. sitting in the garage and seeing it get covered in boxes and gotcha bikes and stuff like that it's so like you're probably thinking like someone could probably treat this thing better right yeah and he'd rather go with it like he'd rather have it go to family he wanted it to stay in family yeah, yeah. So. so he gave you a good deal yeah that's uh, awesome a stupid good deal <laughs> Yeah, that's always the best. So it's a 225 out of a TT, right? Yeah. So, like, what are the mods to get you to where you are now? Like, uh, what did he do? So it's because it was done so long ago yeah. in 2005. Yeah. They didn't have like ECU tunes and stuff like that. It was a oh, it's just a chip. Right? It's, it's literally a, a chip yeah, soldered yeah. onto the ECU. Like, I got gotcha, you. It's, it's yeah. old school stuff. Um, front mount. Intake. Um, the exhaust is kind of shit. It's a um, two and a quarter. Okay, uh, yeah. You, so it's got more headroom then. Yeah, I want to do like a two, at least like a two and three quarter. Yeah, you, all the way. Is the downpipe done? Yeah, yeah downpipe's okay. done. Uh, it's KO4. Okay, stock, so yeah. stock KO4. Uh, yeah, okay. I think, that, I think that's it, really. Yeah. It comes with two two five, so it's like. So with all that stuff plus the tune, you're expecting yeah. like 300 yeah, issue, yeah. somewhere around. 300. Like crank, yeah, or horse, like wheel. I think wheel. I think yeah. it's over. It, I think it's over. So why do why do you have like the fluttery noises? Is that like uh, a, do you have a blow off valve on this thing? Yeah, so oh, it's okay. uh, it's a forged splitter technically. Uh, it's like a a diverter. Diverter. Valve, right? It diverts 50. I have well. You can set it to full blow off or full divert. Nice. So this one I have I have it set on fifty percent divert nice. and fifty percent. Uh, so, sounds and, nice. Yeah, that's, that's usually that's like just regular <laughs> pressure. I forgot the difference. What's that sound there? Uh, tire rubbing. Oh, okay, that's tire. It's a weird tire rubbing sound. Right, here we go, man. Mason sent me a link one 
day, probably yeah. what, like probably like a month ago now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he just sent me a Facebook link and he's like, "Go, go, go, buy these, buy these now." Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, pretty much, if he if I didn't buy them, he was gonna buy them. Okay, okay. Uh, How much were they? Four hundred bucks. Oh yeah, that's a good deal. Four hundred bucks. They're seventeen by eight, eighteen thirty-two. Thanks for the ride. Yeah. Yeah, this thing is awesome. I like it. Pretty sick. Yeah, I like it a lot. <laughs>